Hello everyone, welcome back to Thief the Black Parade. So, we're continuing with mission 6 here. I have not recorded this in over two weeks, so I kind of had to get my bearings here. Two guys conversing over here. Oh. Careful. I'll just leave that guy alone. <coughs> oh, these rooms are connected. Must be. <coughs> See, I have not recorded this in a while though, because I was too sick to. I'm back now. Ah, sir. Please prepare the vacant guest room to receive translator Gamal. She is not to be disturbed under any circumstances when she is in her quarters. Make sure the nearby hall is dead silent as well. I do not wish to provoke the first keeper's ire. Nathaniel. <clears throat> I'm just gonna skim through that. Can't really read too well. It's my throat being all messed up still. Hey, Ew. who in the hell are you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness, really? What did I save last? Look. I thought I heard <clears throat> something. Oh, there's too many guards in this place. <clears throat> Here, knock him out. <clears throat> Yeah, a little update on me. I cannot get rid of this cough, so expect there to be quite a few cough attacks in this Let's Play from now on, probably. Oh boy, okay, we're back here now. Central Library. Okay, I know where I'm at now. <clears throat> to restricted oh that's where you get to the restricted library at okay let's go there <coughs> mm. <coughs> he sounds like me what was that sound? cough on a bunch <clears throat> I did record Amnesia quite fine, but ugh, this, I don't know why, but my throat is really bugging me tonight. can hear me up here. Restricted library, no acolytes allowed beyond this point. <coughs> Was this going to be a creepy area? Yeah, lock that. Oh, I recognize that music. That's from Better Tomorrow, that music. Oh, those statues are creepy. Oh, I like the particle effects in here. Really cool looking. Uh, 
on the choice of the Darkwatch site. Darkwatch Sanctuary was founded in 722 in the Industrial District with the purpose of breaking the secret of the impassable gates in the South Grotto. Speculations abound with regards to what is found beyond the mysterious gates, as a strong magic presence can be felt, but in a hundred years none has been able to break the seals. It is theorized by Superior Elder Silvis, currently the head of Dark Watch, that a powerful artifact is needed to unseal the doors. Okay, the artifact was rumored to be the fabled Chilic Amulet, of which parts have been scattered to the four winds and have eluded our order for centuries. The location of Dark Watch Sanctuary is also strategically advantageous, as the now old industrial districts close to Merc Bell, High Watch, and Lampfire Hills. This has allowed our order to observe with great attention the power struggles on the northeast bank, and to intervene should be should the balance be broken. The Hammerites of Saint Trinet, for instance, have started to quarrel with the Hammer Hill seat and may try a coup. We must be village vigilant if this happens. Keep revenge shot. Okay, Clinics of keepers who strayed from our purpose. Any brethren listed here should be found and captured at all cost for the danger that they represent. Interpreter Lance, misreading a prophecy without any attempt at correction, responsible for disastrous consequences. Keeper Renewald, revealing, has told up to ten individuals about the existence of our organization in a tavern. Elder Adarius, abuse of glyphs, has subjugated an innocent mind for two years. Shrap terror sex. Dark magic used the study of the glyphs for destructive purposes. Keeper Olasian, murder, killed Elder Lopus and tried to burn the evidence. Keeper Olstein, betrayal, has broken, has stolen several important tomes and fled to Roxburg. Could he be an order or spy from the mysterious order? Elder Dan, abuse of glyphs, illegal use of the glyph of the youth for sentimental reasons. Shrive Vanton, misappropriation, has stolen a dozen dangerous tomes without authorization for personal interest. Keeper T Tedious, Betrayal, Attempted Assassination of Third Keeper Orland. Keeper Jonas, Revealing, Sent Secret Messages to the Wrong Address for Five Years, Denies His Mistake. Keeper Mercedes, Misappropriation, Used Keeper Training for Personal Interests such as thievery, Blackmail, and Other Crimes. I think that might be referencing the character Mercedes from the Kalender series. Oh god. Was that? I hear someone up there. What the hell? Is there an invisible person here? <coughs> Yeah, I won't be reading everything. My throat does not allow me to do that. There's someone down here. Oh, what the hell? I'm getting a really strange vibe from that little girl. Creepy. With her. Oh my god. That is so creepy. What the hell? That's all speak a model. It's so creepy. Oh, there you are. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my goodness. She turns into the hag. Oh my goodness, that is so cool. Terrifying. Oh god. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh god. <clears throat> 
Well, let's not alert her, because that is very dangerous. Oh my goodness, that is terrifying. Oh god. Oh, don't see me. That is so fucking terrifying, oh my goodness. <clears throat> I gotta see that again. That is actually crazy. <laughs> actually kill her or is she invincible? I don't know. Those things turn into fucking statues. Just like that part in Thief 3. I wanna get her to turn into that down there so I can take a screenshot of it. Oh god. Let's just avoid her. God, it is so terrifying. Oh my goodness. Oh god, there's so much marble. Oh my goodness, how are we getting through here undetected? <laughs> so I actually get to see her as the hag in this. It's just so cool. How did they get to, like, how did they make them new motions and stuff? I'm getting a really strange vibe from that little girl. Oh, oh kill her or not. I'm just gonna <laughs> assume you can't. They get some cool screenshots out of it though. Just have to sneak around here I guess. God there's not many places to sneak up here. Too much marble. As soon as she sees it she turns into that. Oh my goodness. Terrifying. Mm -hmm. Okay, careful. <clears throat> Should, can I hide here? Oh, good. Oh, I found it. <clears throat> speaking voice writing. <laughs> Azaran the Cruel, Necromancy, the Black Parade, and its schism from the Hand Brotherhood. <clears throat> the origins of the Hand Brotherhood are mysterious to say the least. They are considered a caste outside any jurisdiction in their place of origin in the Far East. They travel the world, establishing sanctums to study various magical phenomena. Two such sanctums are in the heartland, a complex of towers beyond the city known as the Mage Keep, and another sanctum within the city inside the old High Watch Castle. An archmage of your Dubij 
close, chose to be interred here. We believe his choice was not at the random, and the arrival of Hand Renegade Air Azaran the Cruel in the city all but confirms this. Azaran, an infamous and ancient mage, is an avid practitioner of necromancy. For this, he was exiled from his homeland in the Far East and branded a heretic by the Hand Brotherhood. Due to both his interest in necromancy and his desire for revenge against his homeland, Azaran gained a following that coalesced, coalesced into a rogue mage enclave, the Black Parade. The Hand Brotherhood and Nat thematized this group circa 827. <clears throat> Why did Azaran seek out the heartland and the city? With the acquisition of a rare extract, taken from the last anti-necromantic necromantic mage polemic of tears at tablets, we have a reasonable answer. Most of the obscure incantations and odd imagery in our extract is meaningless without the whole text. However, the subject of the great concern recurs throughout. There exists a physical source of some awful magic with the power to capture the souls of those who touch it. The sentient object, unnamed and undescribed out of fear, was alleged at the time the tablets were carved to be in the heartland. If this remains true today, it explains Azaran's choice to settle the Black Parade in the city. Such a vessel of souls would provide ample fuel for any necromantic rituals. Fortunately, even our limited extract contains the central purpose of Abutiar's tablets to archive the method that the Hand Brotherhood devised to annual necromancy and to travel to the realm where these captured souls reside. The extract speaks of three artifacts that the Hand Brotherhood has enchanted for this purpose. They are as follows. A rectangular ruby, initially sealed in a casket by Archmage Kurak, later retrieved by Tomb Raider circa 702. After some time in illegal trade, it was acquired by Messer Gustavio Aldrius and earned the title Adrius Demise after he ingested the gem in a fatal effort to conceal it. it resides in his family tomb within the catacomb complex beneath Stormark. Guess we are already there in mission four. Or, yeah. A signet ring with a sapphire stone in the care of Archmage Tegir. Locked away in a large mage mortuary in Hag Hill Forest. From the two unsuccessful expeditions we have sent there to recover Al UTR's tablets, we know that the Amethyst Harp was crafted as part of a trial for hand acolytes to access Tejir's tomb using magical silk strings from a source inside the complex, and have high confidence that the tablets are buried within gold amulet worn by Archmage. Dubich, resting with him in his sepulchre at High Watch Castle. We have failed to earn, learn the purpose of this relic, and it may even be purely ceremonial. Many questions remain. Can the sentient vessel be destroyed? If so, would this trap the souls within forever? Did the Hand Brotherhood devise their method to enter this realm of souls in the hope of rescuing them? Has such an endeavor been attempted before? Without the original tablets, we cannot begin to guess. We are unsure whether the tablets even hold this information. In secret, we have investigated the archives of the Hand Brotherhood for answers, or a complete copy of the tablets, but we have found no trace of them. Necromancy has been a forbidden dark art for so long among the Hand Brotherhood. There is a chance that knowledge of this necromancy safeguard has been lost among their members, leaving them with no way of dealing with Azeran and the Black Parade, should they ever locate and use this sentient vessel of souls. The Hand Brotherhood wants to destroy these necromancers. I know that bastard Dewal has Aldrius' demise, and the Brotherhood already has the amulet. If I get that ring, too, they'd have everything they need to stop Azaran. And if they succeed, would that remove this curse? Hmm, maybe. Ugh, readable. And of course, OBS stopped recording. I don't know why. There was another readable I read. I guess I'm gonna have to do it again. Ugh, ridiculous. Anyways. I said before, I think the whatchamacallit, the heart must be in here too, I'm thinking. Oh my goodness, I can't believe I just like paused the recording. Anyways, watch out for that creepy girl down there. Yeah, I didn't read this, but I skimmed through it. 
<coughs> so, well, Tatiana's Flowers, which was in the original game. I'm kind of just skimming through these parts because I just was at this area, but stupid OBS decided to stop recording out of nowhere. That's always fun. Anyways, there's a bunch of burnt books here. One of them has interesting lore in it. Basically goes over the Bridesmaid Betrayer and the stuff that goes on in Thief 3. I'm not reading it again, because I just read that whole thing out loud and wasn't even recording it. It's always fun. Oh, anyways. Where does this go? Sleep back to the city? But <sighs> well, I know it's sad before it was too late. <laughs> before I got the whole mission <laughs> not recorded. Not as I fall down there. Oh, not to mention my recording times all divided up now, so I'm not even gonna know how long I was recording for. So, thanks, OBS. God, I can't stand OBS sometimes. It's not the first time that's happened where I'll... where I've accidentally hit the pause record button. I don't even know when I hit it. <laughs> Where does this lead to? Back to the city? Sad. This actually leads to something useful. Like the harp, for example. Skamal's house? Looks like it must be. All this weird pig and stuff. So to get the harp though, so I have to go back down to the frickin' keeper place then, because I'm still not done down there. Where did it say the? I don't remember where it said the harp is. Yeah, I'm gonna be constantly looking over at OBS to make sure it's recording now. Love that. We're looking right at the top of the most tower. Oh, okay. Well, I'll just cut when I'm back to the beginning of the library. Okay, we made it back. <laughs> I just hopped down. <coughs> okay, I know where the North Tower is. Let's get over there. I do not like that area. Creepy little bitch in there. Really? I already had to worry about her, now I have to worry about these annoying guards? Okay, there we go. Save after that. <coughs> this time, sneak, because I'm not freaking dealing with that asshole down there. God, maybe there wasn't like 500 keepers in this place. <laughs> not to say that's not accurate for the keeper compound, but still, oh my goodness. Can I just get down back to where I was without getting caught? Oh, don't see me. Someone's skulking around here. No. Jerk. Also, this voice sounds a lot like it's one of the original voice actors. I was already in there. Okay. I just have to find the North Tower. <clears throat> Which tower should be off to this side over here? I do want to eventually explore the whole place. There's a lot to do in this place still. Okay. 
Bowser Stein Arms. Let's go up here first. No. Hmm. That was nothing. As always. Ooh, that's a nice looking dining room. Wow. Ooh, this is all valuable. Oh, I can't take the cheese wheel. It's lame. I love this cave texture. Really pretty and cool looking. <laughs> Is this like a hot tub? Okay. Oh, reach a little call, okay. So I guess when I leave, I could just go back to my starting point without exploring the city area, but I'm going to explore the city area, obviously. Completely skipped all that, so I could come right to this place. This is the North Tower here. Power balance and dark smoke. Dark smoke has seen power struggles ever since its creation centuries ago. Initially a trading post for coal, it soon started developing into a burg that housed the miners toiling in the dark calories and quarries of the Inrovo mountain range. Growing at a rapid rate, the burg eventually became its own town and was officially recognized as a quarter of the city. This vast expansion did not stop, and it was soon faced with a conundrum. Indeed, many mine owners, as well as factory owners and merchant princes, were in open conflict between each other and the city council. While most of the first of this conflict was inconvenient, economical in nature, several massacres were committed, no doubt inspired by the countless civil wars Sirica has known throughout its long history. Dark smoke and nobility eventually mellowed with time, and the once prosperous quarter is now mostly comprised of disused factories, haunted mines, and a few active refineries. <laughs> is this a joke? Not only is this essay far too short, but it is also riddled with inaccuracies and fantasy. This book should either be revised or rewritten by someone competent. Elder Cresbury. Well, haunted places are real in the deep universe. Oh, boy. What's in a boat? A bunch of stuff, I don't know. I, like, I apologize if I'm not reading quite a lot of this stuff, but my throat is way too worn out for any of that right now. Okay, so it's at the reliquary at the top of the North Tower. So is that it there? <coughs> Where's it up here? I don't know. I've actually been here before, haven't I? Dormitory. Wait, really? Dormitory? Trust me, Tower. Where's the reliquary? Up there? How the hell do I get up there? I don't have player on stick keys, so I can't check by doing that. <coughs> oh, Tori, I've already been down here. What's up here? Here? Kinda getting off track here, but I did not know we could come up here. Oh, let's appreciate that ambience. Oh, I love that creepy breathing noise in that ambience. Oh, 
what's this? Petrum. <coughs> Where am I? <laughs> Will you stop ah. making noise? No. You stop making noise. Oh god, my stomach's really not <laughs> being nice to me right now. Guess, okay, I need to find out where I'm at. Guest chamber, so I'm down. I got way off track. I was up here, now I'm down here. Oh well. Might as well finish exploring this place while I'm here. <clears throat> and then the next part will be the last part of this mission where I'll just do the city area. In response to your previous message, I did not like the way the third keeper Orland aggressively eyes the position of first keeper. Xavier is old and at the end of his days, while Theobald is feeble and weak, put in his position through shameful nepotism. Orland is the most capable to succeed Xavier should Theobald concede, but I do not think Orland has what it takes to truly rule the order. He is far too bureaucratic and narrow-minded for that. While we need a person of conviction and wisdom, the man is too controlling and is thoroughly obsessed with Garrus, but not in the right way. You know it far more than anyone. A. I truly trust in your judgment regarding for young and skilled for regarding our young and skilled friend and like you I do believe he shall eventually return to us especially with regards to his upcoming tribulations Mercedes is a lost cause but not him far from it Orland does not share this sentiment and would rather have the man hanged and quartered than put his trust into him, even if his very life depended on it. I would like to be proved wrong, but alas, I fear I am right. And God, I can't read. No wonder. Oh, if the stupid cough would leave, it would be way easier to do my commentary. Oh. <clears throat> Where does the translator? Most esteemed translator, I am, again, so very honored and humbled to receive your illustrious, illustrious person within the halls of the First Keeper's Watch. You already know it, but I grant you free access to all the books we possess in our archives, including the rare and potentially dangerous volumes found within the restricted library. I will concede, or I will provide a ring key to the restricted library when we meet in my office, which is found at the top of the central library. A fellow keeper shall be posted at the entrance should you need assistance in your quest. Yours and knowledge, Superior Elder Nathaniel of First Keeper's Watch. <laughs> huh? well, not much in here. Cool though. Goodness me, there's so many different ways to go in here. That's the main thing that's confusing about this. It's easy enough to follow the map, but man, there's so many different ways to go. Okay, I've already been here. Stuff about Kirsten, the last city. <clears throat> and it's been here. A few rooms off to the side here. Anything else here? Nope. Where's that hallway, hallway, hallway I was in earlier? <laughs> Very nice looking. That was originally my thumbnail. Or it still is the thumbnail for the last part. What am I saying? So I changed my thumbnail. I didn't. So, tower. So, her. It said. Mm hmm. 
message. Our privilege no longer results in now concealed in our rail grid at the top of the north. How do I get up there? I'm gonna have to figure out how to get up there. I'd probably have been up there before, but how do I get up there? There's gotta be a staircase or something to get up there. Whoa. Oh cool, that's a new animation. Hmm? That's a cute animation, I like that. Hmm? Put a book back. I don't know how to get up there. I'll figure it out. A little trial and error. I have to get there from the first floor? Is that it? Oh my goodness. I had to go back down here. <laughs> I think I'd have to go back down to the first floor. Well, I think I've been everywhere in this place now. It's reliquary, reliquary. Okay. Listen, door. Don't do that. Just close. Did I completely miss it by just skipping over this? Yeah, I t <laughs> I knew I missed something. Apparently that staircase had a third way. Okay. Oh, they didn't hear me, did they? Oh, they did. Whatever. Oh my goodness, finally. So the last stop for this place, and then I'm going back to the city area. Oh, there it is. Mark with yourself to get in the fifth mission. This tarp unstrung. Well, all we have to do now is get back to a certain point, but I am actually going to get back over to the city and then probably do the city area in the last part. Okay, I'm just going to get back over to this place. I'm not gross. You could hurt me. You will pay. Bitch. Surprised by that. Okay, just run. No, thank you. Oh my god, that's so creepy. She just runs up here like, no, thank you. Stay away from me. Oh my god. Out of here. Oof. <laughs> oh god, she's still running up here. Quick. Oh, we gotta get out of here. That's close. Oh, thank you. Get me out of there. <sighs> Creepy thing following me. <gasps> the hang. <laughs> Actually, read about that in like the first or second mission, I think. <clears throat> really, really now? Can I please just get out of here? Back up to the streets. 
So I think that's going to be it for this part, actually. So next time we will continue the rest of this mission by exploring the rest of the street area, since I skipped it in the first part of this mission. Now that we're done with the Keeper Compound, so yeah, see you all back for the next episode of the Black Parade when I do that. <laughs> Bye for now. Thank you.